so this originally came with the six speed, uh, and then we upgraded it to the eight speed. So with the eight speed, you're getting, well, and we also did a digital cluster that you can see. Oh, that's so it. So that's the digital cluster. So we can also do custom programming of your company, of any logo, uh, and stuff like that to come up on your digital screen. Oh, that's amazing. So we do all that. Now you see what flushness you're getting. So with that being said, you don't have any more of the big stick sticking up, hitting, you know, you're able to get to your cups. Just give our center console a really clean look. That looks amazing. Okay, so you essentially have one of the newest things that you offer, to, and that's an update on the transmission. Yeah, so uh, obviously being able to move into our new shop, we're now hot riding some of the newer trucks, and that's basically what we've been trying to do without the space. So now with the space, this is our newest update for the early uh, sports and the LR4s that came with the six speed and the uh, stick as a shifter. So this allows you to adapt to your, uh, your early trucks, uh, the V8 uh, transmission. So we have built a custom uh, flywheel and then we give you all the details and this is between Rocky Mountain British and us at Roadside Works. We've all collabed on this. Uh, we make all the special connectors and the pins and everything you need to be able to plug the transmission into your factory wiring. And we've got all the pins and everything that you need to do uh, with that. And then we give you the part numbers on what center console to buy. So we can help you with that, but you might be able to find it in your parts yard or places like that. Um, and then these guys, Rocky Mountain British and us have all collabed on this guy. Shows you everything you need, all the part numbers and how to install uh, and that. And then we have a test mule that I'll show you um, that we've had no issues with since we've installed. So we think it's been a great, uh, not only interior kind of cleanup, mm -hmm but also gas mileage and usability of the truck um, has been really beneficial as well. So, and everything's built in, nothing's, other than what we send you is in the custom package is all you need. Everything else is factory, so there's none of this hodgepodging, no gluing, none of this other stuff. It all just either bolts together or screws together the way it should from the factory. And if somebody asks, well, what's the benefits of doing this versus just keeping what I have? So if you have the six-speed, you'll probably start to price out that you'll find the six-speed is quite an expensive transmission, but there is a, since the window of the six speed is fairly short, I would mm -hmm. say, mm -hmm. the eight speeds have now have a larger window. There's a lot more of these uh, eight speed transmissions out there, good used. So you can pick up a really good used uh, eight speed and buy our package and probably be still less than what the other transmission might cost you, wow. depending on what you're looking at. So whether you're buying a brand new six speed from the dealership, which is fine, yeah. uh, or you're having a good reman company do it, which is also fine, you might still find that buying a good uh, eight speed and yeah. one of our packages yeah. um, is cheaper. And then it also opens the door to paddle shifters, mm -hmm. uh, gives you more uh, accessibility of the transmission in terms of what gear you want to be in for towing, uh, and then also gas mileage and stuff like that. So that was our biggest uh, deal to do that, and also just to give you a cleaner look inside the truck. And you have now one here that has the eight-speed conversion. Yeah, and I'll be glad to show you guys here. Uh, so this is a 2010-11 Sport. Um, and before we even step, so this has been one of our other test mules. A lot of guys have seen this on our page. Uh, so this has got the big brakes that we did, Monster Brembo calipers. Oh, that's absurd. Yeah, good boys. So we're offering that on, as a kit with the LR4s and all that, and uh, and then obviously. Okay, so you op so, offer the big brake kit. Yes, yeah, so we offer the big brake kit uh, for the sports and for the LR4 that you're seeing back there. Okay. Uh, then this one does not have to run a lift. It's running the X lifter. So this one gives uh, about seven different positions that it can ride at, and I can show you that inside here. Uh, and then with this one, this truck is running the eight-speed. So this originally came with the six-speed. Uh, so this originally came with the six-speed, 
Uh, and then we upgraded it to the eight speed. So with the eight speed, you're getting, well, and we also did a digital cluster that you can see. Oh, that's so it. So that's a digital cluster. So we can also do custom programming of your company, of any logo. Uh, and stuff like that to come up on your digital screen. Oh, that's amazing. So we do all that. Now you see what flushness you're getting. So with that being said, you don't have any more of the big stick sticking up, hitting, you know, you're able to get to your cups. Just give our center console a really clean look. That looks amazing. Okay, so we, last LR4 that we shot did, was let's say, had more performance than the stock one did. Yeah, so that was the first North American supercharged LR4 with 700 horsepower. And since then, we've obviously done some more. And this is just another one of a local customer here in Colorado. He'll be about the second or third guy to get this as well. He had a uh, V8 naturally aspirated truck uh, that had some problems and really loved this truck. So didn't know what to do with it over a year. Came to us when he saw the video that our man right here made for us, which we can't thank him enough. And with that being said, we took this from a naturally aspirated truck to a supercharged V8 truck. And this truck has also got the 700 horsepower tune on it. Uh, and also with the transmission tune as well. Um, so it performs just as well as the other truck that you saw. Um, and yeah, and the other trucks had no issues. So right now, so, roughly, this is about 700 horse. Yeah, this is like 682, I believe is what our tune is actually. I say seven, but it's yeah. about 682 is on the dyno at the rear wheels. So, and he kept the six speed on this. Yeah, so we got the six speed. This is an early truck. Uh, the eight speed might be in the works in a little bit, but uh, for budget wise and for what we we're trying to do, we have, we've been doing a bunch of other things to this truck. So uh, yeah, big V8 supercharged 700 with the tune. Uh, been updating grill, you know, grill and giving creature comforts and stuff like that. And then uh, on the inside, we've got it taken apart right now because everything's going to the glossy black. And then we've been two-toning the interior. So in this truck, it was all tan. Okay. We went out and bought a black interior, and we did the dash black with the I call it the waterfall coming down from the dash into yeah. the center console. We did that in black just to kind of open up the truck. We're then going to two-tone the yeah. door panels and and that we did the uh wood wheel and everything in in terms of getting ready to do the a speed so that wheel has got the paddle shift and everything right now which is not hooked up and functional yeah but it it will correspond with the transmission and everything that we'll do later on and we'll that we'll do uh like before after sort of yeah coverage where you have this whole interior is done yeah and... we'll have this truck done probably in the next week week and a half yeah we're just waiting for some reports come back we did do the digital cluster in this one. Uh, this gentleman, if you want to go around, you can open yeah. the door. Okay. And this gentleman owns a hot air balloon company, so you'll see the picture that we did for him. Really? It may not be may not be the one staying, but gives you an idea. Oh, I don't know if we can open it. Hold on. <laughs> That's all right. Look at you. You're just good with them. <laughs> digital clusters now you can essentially yeah program yeah, yeah. this to however you want yeah so this truck came as an analog and we took all the analog cluster out we put the full digital cluster in so obviously this picture is you know what pops up for his home screen and anybody's truck so if you have a company we'll put yeah. your company logo in we'll put the any company picture that you've got uh, and then from there we then can customize so like when this truck does come on the all the uh, gauges and everything like that are carbon fiber with red needles yeah we can pro so <laughs> our test truck when it says it wants gas it comes up as a dollar sign <laughs> so we can put we can change the the actual logos around to different things like that our guys are on top of it okay. so yeah if you want a digital cluster in with special stuff we got you and what is uh something like this to do with digital cluster update run uh, the cluster itself is not bad you can buy them uh used on ebay so we, you know you can scoop them up i would say for 100 to 200 dollars uh, and then the programming and things like that just depends on what you're trying to have done. Uh, Jordan has it all worked out to specific, you know, yeah. if you want certain gauges, certain things like yeah. that. There's a price for everything, okay. uh, and it's it's actually somewhat of, it's pretty affordable. So nothing too over the top there. That's, you guys are always adapting and yeah, coming man, out with new. Trying to. You're turning older vehicles into modern, which yeah. I think I like about that. Just 
doing the hot rod stuff for the new vehicles, it's yeah. all the stuff everyone wants. Yeah. It, it, it's just no one was out there doing it, and we had the ability to do it. Yeah. We just didn't have the location and the size to be able to offer it all. Yeah. So now that we're able to do the old style stuff and all the new stuff, yeah. we have a lot of new stuff to offer. And I think you, I think a lot of customers will be happy that it's all factory stuff yeah. that we're just tweaking in ways that doesn't affect anything. Yeah. So you get all the fun stuff, but you don't have to worry about some Jerry rigged up thing, yeah. wires coming out of this, special buttons to push. It, it's factory done. Yeah. So it works out great. You guys so, are doing amazing work. Well, and I'll be it, excited to see what this looks like when it's all yeah, done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so too with all the black accents yeah. and all the stuff done in the door panels. So yeah. next couple of weeks we'll get you to come back down and definitely check it all out. And uh, yeah, go from there.